Good morning. Today we are going to plant some potatoes. It's kind of a bit of a gamble because it's going to rain for the next two weeks, but this is the time to plant them. So I'm like, hmm, will it work or will they rot in the ground? So I'm only planting, how many did we say? 13? 13. 13 little potatoes. So about a pound, almost two pounds of potatoes. I'm going to plant them. My thinking is that maybe the mulch will help absorb the water and they'll be fine. Or it's just going to be like a light sprinkle every day and not like a gully washer like it was last year right after I planted potatoes. So again, and that's why I'm only planting rotted. a couple pounds out of my 25 pounds. But some of them rotted. Yeah, and some of them stinked. rotted. And then it stinked. Yeah. Yeah, it was not very fun. And they didn't grow anything. So we're going to try this. See how it goes. Some of them growed. Yeah, some of them grew. So we're just going to take the whole little potatoes that were in my bag of all the potatoes. So, you know, basically everything that's this size. Everything else is like a lot bigger, so we're going to cut them probably to make more plants. But I don't want to do that with the rain coming. So I'll do that like after the rain passes, I think. So that's what we're going to do right now. I'm seeing if them are not mushy. They're not mushy. They're yeah. actually really nice looking potatoes. Nice and firm still, just a little bit of sprouting. They're it's good potatoes. hard. This one's hard. Good. So what I think I'm going to do is just pull back the mulch a little bit. Oh, hey, Wormy. Can I see? Little tiny baby Wormy. Just pull back the mulch a little bit, stick my shovel in, and dig a deep hole down a few inches into the dirt, and then plant my potato. I'm going to have you lay them down. So put one, like, right here. We're going to space them out first, and then we'll come back and shovel them. Okay, and so one right here, and then one like right here. One. Okay, one right here. I tossed that. One right here. One right on your finger. Mm-hmm. Yep, one right here. And one right here. Okay. All right, that's how I'm doing it. Anna's taking it. I'm poking a hole, pushing it forward, stuffing the tater down in there, and then put some compost on top. This is kind of how Kate from Venison for Dinner did this, but she did not add compost. Of course, I'm just adding it just because. And I think her potatoes ended up a little deeper. Potato. Yep, and then we'll cover it with some mulch in a little bit. This is what I'm doing. And that's her job. This is hard to dig and video at the same time. It's too hard. Okay, I'll help. And this last part, we're just going to cover them up with water, or with this mulch that I raked off earlier. I will probably have to add more mulch as the season goes, but I'll probably do like leaves or straw or something. We'll see. Like the straw we got? Yeah, like the straw we got last year. Maybe we'll get some. Or some scraps or something. And we'll plant there. done we have two rows so one row here one row I don't know if I'm gonna use that time lapse I just took or not uh, kind of cut off most of the ground I thought it was pointing more towards the ground but whatever anyway it did not so we planted a row there row over there we have 13 potatoes in here see if they sprout just lightly covered them back over the mulch I may take the cut up potatoes that I just cut up inside that you didn't see and make a line down the middle I don't know if that's too close or not 
we'll see. I don't know, they're probably like 18 inches apart maybe, the rows are, so I don't know. I'm not planning on healing these guys, just covering them with mulch and stuff. So, we'll see. I think that's going to be it for this video, just a short and sweet potato planting video. We'll probably make another planting video when we do the rest of the 25 pounds. So, I mean, we have like uh, 23 pounds left, plus we got a few more pounds, so we still have like 27 pounds of potatoes to plant. Yep, it's going to take a little bit. I probably won't show every potato I plant, but you know. We might do another video. We'll see. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to be subscribed so you can know when these potatoes are sprouting because I will be sure to let you know. It'll be an exciting day. See you next time.